Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcome you to episode 6, I think, I hope, of Let's Play Diddy Kong Racing. And I just learned something that I never knew about this game. And you're about to see what it was, and I thought it was just so hilarious when I first turned on. Like, I had to sit there for like a minute just like laughing before I started recording. <laughs> and I'm still kinda, I still kinda have the, like, the giggles, so, pardon me. But, um, you can see that I have 21 balloons now, whereas at the, oh, damn it, it spoiled it. Well, I had 22 balloons at the end of the last episode. And I'm like, what the hell? Like, when I went to start recording today, I was like, what the hell? Where'd that 22nd balloon go? So I went on, and I just saw this balloon just floating out in the middle here. And I don't know why it did. I could have sworn I, like, saved after that genie plane race thing. But apparently I didn't, and so it just sat out here floating the whole time while I was away. Oh, and I haven't recorded this in so long that I feel kind of uh, weird, but... Yeah, I, I honestly never knew that that, that that balloon would just stay there if you didn't collect it, and, and it would just, like, like even after the challenge and after you've, like, turned off the game, you could just, like, go for months just letting that balloon float around. And nothing would ever happen to it. It's crazy. Oh, anyways. So what was I doing? I know I was in the snow world. I think I was doing silver coins last time. Oh, I actually just went back and watched the last video. Well, I watched, like, the end of it to kind of get bearings here. Guess I'm doing this course, okay. This is Frosty Village. Oh my god, this is gonna be... <laughs> this one can be kind of annoying, honestly. I spent a fair amount of hours doing this one as a kid. Uh, I hope not to spend a fair amount of hours doing it this time. Uh, but there are pretty... There are some, like, dickish location ones. Like, you saw that one, like, right off to the left at the start there. And I just hit that tree. <laughs> I couldn't tell if I hit it at first or not. But then it became evident that I did, and I was very sad. Alright, there should be one right there. Uh, if you can't do sharp turns, or if you can't figure out how to do sharp turns like I couldn't, it can be kind of hard to get that one. But if you can, it's rather easy. Oh, I missed that one over there. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't think it's possible to get all, this, all the silver coins on the first lap of this. Well, it, it is if you, like, like do U-turns and shit, but that's just wasted time. Unnecessarily wasteful of time. Right, there's one over to the side here, or not? Oh, I think that's on the other side. That yeah. I think that's how it goes. Right, I think is this in Second Adventure? Or this one, um, that must be in Second Adventure, cause like in the, I I sincerely remember like one. Of, there's a silver coin like right over that bump, like right at the bottom of that bump that goes down the middle of that area, at least towards the house. I don't know if <laughs> I can't really explain that too well. But yeah, dude, I missed that other one. Oh my god, I only have like half the coins, and I'm in third place. I have a feeling I'm not going to get it this time, but oh well. Love this course enough that I can do it a million times. Not on video, of course. Probably have to edit some of that out. If I do do it a million times. Hmm, do do. Oh, yeah. Oh, by the way, that last in that last episode, um... I was talking about like some guy that I remember to be really persistent in a movie, but I couldn't put my finger on it, and I had—I don't know why, because it's like one—it's like my all-time favorite movie that I was thinking about the guy in. And as I thought about it more afterwards, I realized, well, it's not really that like <laughs> that good of an example of persistence, but it's that guy in Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Uh, I think his name—what the hell is his name? He's like a main character. It's like Edward Rooney or something. And just, like, how much time he spends and how much effort he goes through, even when he's had, like, his ass bitten by a dog or whatever, to, like, get into that house. It's just, like, ridiculous. Like, dude, just give it up. Come on. Oh, it's like, dude, it's like one kid. What about the rest of the school? What are they gonna do while you're gone? Well, I guess you don't really serve much of a purpose at the school anyways. Anyways. How's everyone doing today? Today is July 19th that I'm recording this. Um, I'm actually just recording this after a power edge that I just finished. Oh, I think I know where I missed the last coin last time, too. So I should be able to get that one. Oh, yeah. But this, this is like the second power edge like, in a row in like two days. Like, we had one yesterday and we just had one today. Uh, but the one yesterday was kind of weird because it wasn't like from a thunderstorm like this one was. It was just because the electric company was being stupid or something. I don't know the details or anything. It's just... Oh, yeah, all I know is that the electric truck was, like, pulled over by the police. I don't know, maybe they were, like, trafficking some, traffic some drugs there or something. Or they were screwed. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, something else I wanted to talk about in this video. I just have, like, so much to talk about in this video. And this is a good game to talk over, because it's not really much gameplay that you can talk about since you're pretty much doing the same thing over and over. Well, now I'm at fourth. Oh my god, I don't... <laughs> I don't... I don't remember the characters being this fast. Dude, what's wrong with me? Alright, where did I miss that last one? Uh, oh yeah, something else I wanted to talk about is that... I think I might start posting two videos a day again. Like, one Kirby video and one uh, Diddy Kong Racing video. I'm only going to post this tonight because I don't <laughs> I don't have the time or energy to go record another one. That should not have hit him. Oh, it's over there. Okay. Oh, yeah, I think I'm going to start doing that. It's like, And it's not because like I want the LPs to go by fast. Like, far from that. I just I want this LP to last for, like, ever if possible. Uh, but... I don't know, it's just like, I don't want to get into another kind of slump, like I did with like Majora's Mask and Mario RPG, where I'm just sitting there for months and months and months stuck on the same game, because after that long, you start to get, like, no matter how good the game is, you do kind of start to get annoyed with it, and just like, man, I want to be recording something else, like Super Mario Sunshine or something. Alright, dude, can I, oh my god, oh, I missed the zipper, but I got the, I got the coin and it just didn't win. Well, damn it, that sucked. Oh, yeah. But anyways, just let me know what you guys think about me posting two videos a day again. Um, I did that at the start of Mario RPG and Majora's Mask, because, I don't know, but then I realized, well, maybe that's too long of time for people to have to watch videos. So if I did post two videos a day again, then I might just have to make each video, like, 12 minutes or less, so that you don't have to watch, like, half an hour every single day, even though I know some of you would really willingly do do that based on the comments. Oh, and you people, you're crazy. You're really crazy. Because <laughs> you can watch my shit for like half an hour every day. That's just insane. Yeah. Oh, uh, So yeah, let me know what you think about that and um, we'll see where it goes from there. Don't really have much else to talk about here. I do have one story I want to tell, but I think I might wait for that one. Because uh, I don't want to have to... I don't want to force you guys to sit through and watch this again, so I'm probably just going to cut to the end or something. Eh, third place. What kind of place is third place? I'll tell you what it is, it's bronze. But you don't get bronze in this game. You either win or you get jack shit. So, there you go. You can't get a bronze balloon, even though the balloon kind of look bronze all the time. Okay. Maybe I should be collecting bananas to help myself go faster. You know, bananas. You need to eat lots of bananas to help you poop. And the more you poop, the more awesome it is. Oh, so you don't get constipation, you know. Stop talking about that, that's nasty. Okay. Oh, oh yes, I hit her awesome. I love when you hit someone and they're just like, you just see bananas fly out of them. And you can like, you can like, even like hear them scream, just like, My bananas! Well, you can't actually, but... I just imagine that you can't. It's like, I like to hear people wriggle and writhe for their bananas. That sounds somewhat sexual. Get these three bananas down here. Dude, bumper. Oh my god. Oh, you know, it'd be fine if it was like Banjo or something beating me, because Banjo, he's actually kind of cool, but Pipsy? I know she's like one of the best racers in the whole game, based on like her stats or whatever. Her non-visible stats, but still. Okay, I have one whole lap to catch up here, because I don't even have to worry about the silver coins anymore. Let's get these bananas over here. And I should have got that balloon, but oh well. Alright, I think I got it this time, guys. Uh, phew, if I do have it, then I'm going to have to probably show that whole race, which is bad, because that was the shittiest commentary ever. Because I don't even remember what I was talking about. Oh, I got up to ten bananas? How'd that happen? Oh, yeah. Dude, if you're not missing the zippers, then you got this. Seriously. Alright, come on. I know there's a red balloon right up here, so I can hit her with that if I'm lucky. Yes, okay. Yep, they have a really wide hitbox with that. I remember that from when I was a kid. Like, I like pretty much every time I shot them... Oh, I won that time. Yay! Every time I, like, I would, like, shoot in their general direction, I would just hit them. And I think they do that just to, like, make the kids feel good. Like, they have good accuracy or something. Because I know that I felt so proud every time I hit one of them. And I hit one of them every time, so I'm just like, man, I'm so awesome at this game. 
That combined with the fact that I can be Snowpoke every time, that's just so cool. I'm the coolest kid on the block. And according to me, I was. Even though I really wasn't, I had like no friends. Oh wait. If you can beat me again, I'll give you a special prize. Oh god, I love your voice, Mr. Walrus, so much. Oh, I have no idea what time I'm up to now, because I probably cut out some of that stuff. Alright, but here, this race can actually be kind of tricky, as I figured out in, like, one of my practice runs. Oh, especially if you're doing that, dude, I'm bouncing. Bouncing around like a bouncy ball. Oh, yeah, he's just gonna leave his snow dust in your face. Get your face out of my face, walrus brain! Okay. Oh, maybe I can hit him with this? Probably not. <laughs> no, <laughs> I hit the tree with that, I guess. Oh, but I'm not a lumberjack. And I'm not okay. So. Alright, come on. Let's catch up with him. Pass the snowballs with faces. These weren't here in the first race. Uh, and they're really uh, scary because that one should have hit me there. I remember getting scared by those every time as a kid because, like, they just... They come ridiculously close to hitting you, but I honestly think I've never even gotten hit by one of those. So. Uh, well, I hit him. I don't think that's going to be enough for me to win, though. Oh my god! No, I lost to Snowpoke! No, I lost to Snowpoke! <sighs> okay. Dude. Oh, never mind, kid. It sounds like he was just expecting something better from me. Oh, I thought you were cool! Alright, let's do it again. Oh, this is better than facing down a water wraith, I guess, though. Man, look at that guy's face carved into the mountain, like, off in the distance there. He's just like, yeah, I'm big, I'm bad, I'm walrus man. I'm snow- Dude, you hit that wall again. You're such a dumbass sometimes. Aw, oh, dumbass like a few ass. That tunnel there, the one that we just, like, exited from, that reminds me of that one tunnel in Ice Age. You know, like, the one that they, like, go, like, sliding through and it's so fun. And it's like, they should, like, die, but obviously they don't, because it's like a kid's movie. Uh, so everything's just perfectly, like, sculpted to be a slide. And it's just like, wee, Or it's like, FWOOSH! Through the candy cane. Through the candy cane gates. Oh, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can, I know I can't, though. Oh my god. No, I hit the tree. Hit the tree, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. No, okay. I'm just gonna restart there. <laughs> Don't wanna have to sit through that lame cutscene every time that I lose. Alright, come on. We're gonna do it this time. I have a feeling in my gut. In me bones. I've got a feeling in me bones. Oh. You see ash, I see go. And you've got to sweep, you've got to sweep. Until you moan. Yes! You've got to work your fingers to the bone. Yes, we've got to work our fingers to the bone. Yes, you absolutely positively got to work your fingers to the bone. Alright, how do I get ahead of him there? Like, it looks like at one point he just, like, fell down a hole or something where he, like, tripped over a snowbank. I don't know, but it looks like he's, like, right on top of me, so I should not get too cocky. Don't get too cocky, Star Fox. <laughs> yeah, I can make that reference now. Oh, and actually know what it means. Have the right to make it. Alright, there we go. I hit him. Dude, don't hit the tree. You dumbass. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose now. I'm gonna lose. Holy shit. Holy shit. No! <laughs> what? 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 I, I could have sworn I was in second there as I crossed the finish. I'm gonna have to look at that in editing or slow it down or something. You know, let's see that in instant replay. Did I shouldn't have though? I totally lost that, dude. That was that was ridiculous. Wow. <laughs> I sw I swear to God, I lost that. But okay, there we go. That's the second piece of the Whiz Pig amulet. So now we have the top half of his face. Get your face out of my place, Whiz Pig. I haven't been saying my catchphrases enough lately. Oh. But according to Tension Move, catchphrases don't make you as funny, which I kind of agree with, but... You know, what are you gonna do? 
I just don't use my catchphrases a lot because I'm like afraid of overusing them. So in so I end up underusing them, and it's just, like that's not. <laughs> I guess that's better than overusing them, but it's just whatever. All right, what am I gonna do now? Man, Whizpig actually looks kind of cool with that like wooden jaw. That's I never really noticed that. Oh well, I think I'm actually just gonna end it off here. I don't know what time I'm up to. I probably because I wanted to like cut some of that out. So I'm probably not up to like 50 minutes or whatever yet. But so we're, we're just going to park on top of this lighthouse because it's cool. Don't slide off now. Alright, and next time I guess we're going to proceed. Uh, maybe I'll do a trophy challenge. Maybe we'll move to Sherbert Island. I don't know. But until then, thank you everyone for watching. And until next time, this is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you and good night.